Everybody, welcome back. My name is Steven. This is a channel that's all about soccer referee education. In this clip, boys, varsity high school soccer, do you think that this grab by white on red is enough to impact red's ability to play the ball? Obviously, there's a foul after by red on, on white, but this first one, when white kind of grabs him on the shoulders there, it seems light to me, and Red's playing right through it. I'm apt not to call this. The second one, though, obviously there's a push in the back or a little trip there. That one's pretty easy. Now, contrast that first clip with this second clip. Same game. We got a through ball going to White. Red's in position, and again, we got White's hands, this time, on the back of Red. And then we have red kind of tripping or running into the back of white's legs. But the first thing that happens is right here. Boom, that little thing. So my question for you guys is, these are always tough for, for, for me. If, you're not, if, if, if you don't have a side-on view and you're running from behind, this is really difficult to see. But obviously, red's got primacy of position. And then white's hands come up and they're on the shoulders of red. So I'm apt to say, if anything happens to red... Man, like, do you call this or do you let this go? And then White gains position in front of Red right here. And it looks like uh, White's legs get clipped right there. And then White goes down. It's outside the area. So you're either calling a foul for Red coming out on that first grab or you're calling a trip in favor of White going in. What's your call?